OpenAI just released an open model called GPT OSS. So here's this tweet from Sam Altman. He says GPT OSS is a big deal. It's a state of the art open weights reasoning model with strong real world performance comparable to O4 Mini, which is absolutely crazy, that you can run locally on your computer or phone with smaller size. So we can also run it on our phone as well. So they are claiming that this is the best and most usable open model in the world right now, which is absolutely amazing. So yeah, this, I just saw this tweet and, and I straight ahead went into the GPT OSS page and I checked it out and you can see it says that we are releasing GPT OSS 120B, which is the bigger model. I think it's around 65 GBs and GPT OSS 20B. This is the model that can run on your phone as well with 16 gigabytes of RAM or memory, I guess. And yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. You can go ahead and read through it. And uh, what they are really claiming is that GPT OSS 120B model achieves near parity with OpenAI's O4 Mini on core reasoning benchmarks while running effectively on a single 80 GB GPU. The GPT OSS 20B model delivers similar results to OpenAI's O3 Mini on common benchmarks and can run on edge devices with just 16 GBs of memory. So this is really great and we can just use it right now. So you can either go to Hugging Face, you can see they have this GPT OSS 120B here, uh, or you can simply go to the Olama and you simply run this command, which is Olama run GPT OSS. And you can see here as well, they have this 20B listed here and 120B. You can see the 120B is 65 GBs and the 20B is 14 GBs. So you can use it using the Olama or the LM Studio. So this should be fairly simple process. If you don't know how to do this, you can watch my previous video. I have shown you how to run models using Olama. It's a fairly simple process. But if you just want to play around with it, simply go to this website called console.croc.com slash playground and here you can see they are giving this model for us to play around for free so if you go down here scroll you will see the 120b and 20b let's choose the 120b and let's say translate hello world in french and submit so you can see it's saying some bonjour le monde. I don't know how to <laughs> how to read that. I just wanted to give it some prompt so that I see if it's working or not. So yeah, this is it. This is how you can use the uh, GPT OSS model. You can now choose the 20B as well and play around with, with it. If you don't want to use this website, you can simply uh, use the Olama and pull this model and simply run it on your local. So yeah, this is it. So go ahead and use this model and let me know what you think about it.